below here. She's ignored. This. So uh, this is how I'm gonna do it first, uh, just to making sure that everybody understands. So what you do is just when I say, are you guys ready? You just say yes, and then we'll do it together. But we do it, chip the spirit, just go like this, create the vision, follow the face, or many, and then just go acha acha. Those of you who don't know is acha acha, it just means that fight, fight, fight. Or go, go for it. Just like keep going, don't stop, okay? Okay, turn on your mic and everybody together with me. Are you guys ready? Yes. 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 Thank you. So before I start, this is our schedule. Our schedule today, we're just going to do two product presentations. If you guys are new in here, what we do a little bit different from the other group is that with the product presentations after when they, uh, you know, do the product presentation, we like engagement. So we like able to participate. Uh, you know, we know, uh, we learn that, you know, the more we engagement, the more you understand, and the more I understand. And so that we don't all don't fall asleep, right? Our goal is to meeting everybody active and engagement so that you can understand and what's the product okay always remember that uh, the product presentations everything is fast okay but when people jump in and talk about testimony those are just testimony so you cannot uh go out there and say this product is worth for this so i just want a clarifications before we start uh that when they say testimony when you go out there and present your product to other pe people don't say that oh miss kathy potter just do her product presentation and this is what she said her product presentation is real fast it's coming for anime but when people jump in and talk about testimony those are just testimony so keep, keep in mind that when you talk about the product just always refer that this is product is worth for this but people testimony and this is work from then it is up to you able to have immune system i just i just want to make it clear before we jump in okay so before we jump in i'm gonna go ahead and do a little presentations on our uh company just briefly so what is anime just briefly uh, anime is a global more offer daily necessary and uh with an absolute uh quality and an absolute price what is here and then uh, anime you could uh be able have a chance to earn a residual income so residual income those of you don't know is residual income it means that you have the chance to earn monthly uh, income comes to your bank or wherever that you feel like it through our referral program referral programs is if you like the product you share it to your family friend and that's what it goes that's that is how you're going to earn your residual income and with anime you can earn your general commission general commission you could get plus or minus 20 dollars or plus or minus 100 1200 per a day we also have bonus but i'm not going to go through the bonus today she's going to break me through uh, again our company is in korea but our headquarter is fda approved and also a uh, headquarter in federal way washington we have a lot of customer out there they're saying that okay if i order this is is it coming from korea or it coming from united states just like you guys know keep in mind is in united states just that our product is from korea okay but the shipping out is from United States, from our headquarters. Uh, beside that, what is in our shopping mall? Our shopping mall, we care healthcare, we care beauty, such as makeup, lipstick, personal care, such as personal, like pad, uh, to pit, toothbrush, everything. Leaving, uh, which is, we carry leaving as well, and we carry food, oatmeal, you know, those uh, small ingredients. Uh, and we have so much more that is going to come out. You guys had to check it out. Okay. For those of you that just in here, haven't checked out your shopping mall, you'll have to. It's a mandatory for you. So within United, uh, within our uh, anime here, it's not just in your USA uh, locations, it's globally. It started from 2009 in Korea, 2010 in the United States. The second one started 2011, opened two, 2014, opened one, Taiwan, 2000, second poll, and 2015. Cambodia opened in 2016. So remember 2016, they had total of three countries. 2017, they had two countries. 2018, they have Australia and Indonesia and, to, and Russia. And the uh, the, lab, the latest one that we have is in China, but this year we also have, they're coming up in UK and I guess New Zealand, uh, New Jersey just opened like two months ago. Uh, Venon's coming up, France is coming up. We have a lot of more. Those are the pre-registered ones. So just keep in mind that you have any family member, friends, or if you want to do business out there, if you find anybody that 
is already our enemy uh, is already have enemy there they, they are uh, can be part of your business partner uh, beside that, why is Anime and why is our company is a little bit different is because our company, um, as you guys can see here, other MLM network marketing, they have only one leader. One leader, it means that whoever they took you in, they always earn the best benefit out of it. But with Anime, we all are a little bit different. We have a cap ceiling. So everybody have a chance to go up to the cap ceiling, which is you have to go through seven uh, steps to get there. And then once you get to the seventh step, uh, you know, our CEO power promise that you will get 50,000 to 100,000 case per a month. Uh, that's the average okay so that's what it says and beside that again our company is absolute quality absolute price on the top of that this is my favorite one uh is three generations income and what that means is that if you know if you have the residual your income with anime and if you no longer exist it or you pass away it the generations the income's gonna pass to your uh you know your husbands and then if your husband is no longer here pass it to your kids your kid no longer here is pass it to your grandkid so for those of you that want to leave a, a legacy to your kids or your grandkid for you they to carry your name out there anime will be your best option beside that with anime we have no fee join we have no SI usage fee we have no money no annual fee no auto shipment or no auto order auto shipment for those of you who don't know is auto shipment auto shipment is just saying that uh they have your credit card on their system and then when the date is time the uh the stuff they which is automatically send it out to your door without you notice beside that we have no capital investment uh what Amy does is just to try you liked it and you share it and then and you have the chance to purchase a discount member price for the best quality product. And on the top of that, again, you will have a chance to earn commission payment if you use through a referral program. Just like it, share it, and that's how you do. And uh, the best thing I like about it is that um, is in anime, you have a better health and also better skin. So we want everybody to have a better skill health and skin okay including me as well so this is it i'm just go through a little or uh, briefly uh on what is anime next week we will go a little bit different we will go through the details so for those of you that just join us tonight so amy every week we do a little bit different uh we always do two weeks for a product presentation and ten testimony and then next week we will go through what is the binary system uh and then go go from there so um Today, we're just going to do a product presentation testimony. Just give you FOI that every week we will do different. Okay. So, here back to our schedule. And, and uh, our schedule, our presentation will be Miss Kathy Porter. Porter, are you ready? She's going to talk about the deep hair claims and Yes, ma'am. I'm ready. Kathy, do you uh, want me to have you share your screen? Uh, if you could just throw that up for me, that would work. Mm -hmm. Go for it. I will do that. And I have a bottle right here mm -hmm. of the Deep Pure Cleansing Oil. That's what I'll be talking about today. Now, what I would tell a customer there's a short version and a long version. The chairman says we should be able to describe any product in a minute or less. So I'm going to see if I can do that first. Okay, first, it smells absolutely wonderful. It's meant for daily use. It helps remove makeup, blackheads, excess sebum, environmental pollutants, and it cleanses your skin without irritating it. Plus, it moisturizes your skin. Now, that's what a, a customer wants to know. What does it do for me? What's in it for me? That's always on their minds. What's in it for me? What I'm going to share with my sisters here tonight and my brother, it moisturizes and softens your skin as it helps your skin release the blackheads, sebum, pollutants in the environment, and it leaves your skin with a softer, smoother finish. Now, I kept reading that word sebum, 
And I had to look it up. That's, and, you know, if I don't know what something is or means, I'm going to look it up. It's an oily, waxy substance that coats, moisturizes, and protects your, sense, your skin. But our skin can produce too much sebum, especially if we have oily skin. But at the same time, oily skin has more in it than sebum. It also has sweat, dead skin cells, and the environment. Now, I've been around skincare, the skincare industry for a while. And what I know for sure, I lived in a city that, in, in fact, I lived about a mile and a half from the steel mill. Biggest steel mill in the world. I lived in Gary, Indiana. And sometimes we'd come outside and get in our car and we'd have to clean the windshield before we could go anywhere because you couldn't see. Well, I started wondering where does all that stuff go when you get out of the car? It's still coming down. It's still in the air. It's going on your skin. And there are days when you could rub your, your face and feel it. You could feel the, the pollutants. And those were hard chemicals. Things like sulfur and, and pollutants that you don't want to breathe, let alone have on your skin. And so your face is exposed every single day. There's not a day of the year that your skin is not exposed, your face and your hands. So when they say oily skin and environmental pollutants, that's serious business. That's where a lot of damage is done to your skin. So this product, deep, pure cleansing oil, helps to remove it from your face. And sometimes we will use this product and then we will use a, a paper towel or a napkin or something, paper to wipe it off our skin when actually we should be washing it off with warm water. Part of the cleansing process with this, and after using this, we don't need to use the foam cleanser. This is a cleanser all by itself. So once we do the water on our skin, we do it several times to get it clear. We don't have to wash our face again. We do, but we don't have to. Um, and it leaves your skin really, really, really soft. And I love that part. Um, Oh, okay. Allergic reactions. And and this is this is just bonus information really. Some people will come back to you and say I had a, an allergic reaction. I'm allergic to this because I've got bumps. Well, something I learned. If they are flesh tone bumps, that just means that the product is working. It's pulling the pollutants and the sebum and the extra dirt and oil and stuff out of your skin. It's working. If the bumps are red, if there's itchiness, then that may indicate a sensitivity to something in the product. Especially if there's a, an, allergic, an allergy or sensitivity to a food item. If you're allergic to oranges, if you use skincare with orange oil or orange seed or whatever in it, you may have a reaction. If you're allergic to lemon or cucumber, there may be a sensitivity to that product. But that's something that the person, that's it's not your responsibility to say, to ask everybody, what are you allergic to? Because we're not selling to children. Okay, so if they can read the 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 description here, it's it's right here. The ingredient list is right there. If they can read it and they see it there, it's their responsibility to say, 
maybe not this product, what else do you have? And then it helps if you can recommend something a little bit different, maybe a different combination of products. Um, that's basically all I have. I love this product. In fact, I use it. This is the testimonial part. I love it. I use it. I don't just use it on my face. If you can use it on your face, you can use it on your body. And it will help to soften the skin, your knees, your elbows, everywhere else that you want smoother, softer skin. This will do it. And then, you know, you use it and you shower it off and your skin is just amazing. It is amazing. So thank you very much, everybody. Thank you, Ms. Kathy. It's real. You guys, anybody want to add in here? Just always remember what Kathy just mentioned earlier. Uh, it always takes three to four months for you to see that uh, whether the uh, product is good for you or, or is bad for you. Okay? So when you do your, when I do the research or, you know, just Google search about skin care and it's, it, ta it says that it takes a full month for your skin to be adapted to the new product. So for those of you that, you know, are using turnover to different mind, just making sure, just like Kathy said earlier, that when you use it, of course, you will have reactions. As long as your reactions is not like, you know, having like it, like a whole bunch of itchiness and you, you know, you know yourself, and you know that your skin is either allergy reactions or either just going through the process of changing different lines, skincare to different That's skin. That's right. Uh, Beside that, did anybody use this one before? I use it and I love it. I, I this is just a testimony, but I use it and uh, I like it the fact that when you use it, you don't have to use the foam cleanser. So it's a little bit different from our deep cleanser. Our deep cleanser, when you use it, it have oil base, oil essential base in there. So it's really oil. But this one is a oil. But when you use it, you don't have to use the foam cleanser. When you're done, you're done. So just give you guys an FOI on that one. So it, it, it cleared out really nice. I love to take it with me when I go traveling because I don't need to take the full uh, evening care set, but just this one. Um, question, mm -hmm. is this good for teenagers that has pimples or is it only for adults? Uh, to me, I think it's good for teenagers as long as they're above uh, 11 years and above or 12 years and above, it should be fine with them yeah as long as they're not like seven eight or nine or ten but i think when they already have the beauty, I think it's good. Okay. now if they i would say if they have and because at the very bottom of this it says don't use on open wounds mm -hmm. and you know sometimes the, the pimples and such get kind of active and they're they're leaking and that sort of thing i would not use it on that skin mm. Okay. Okay. So once it dries, then you can sort of use that. Um, and you will probably see a reduction in the amount of uh, outbreak, especially if they start drinking more water. That was something I wanted to say. Excess oil on your skin is because you're dehydrated. So your body is compensating by moisturizing itself. Okay. So drink more fluids amy um i want to add a little bit on that one too i use it too um so um i use that one and i love it too um it helps uh reduce your uh, pores and then yes it's safe for teenagers to use it um, i have a 13 year old who hit puberty and then um, he have a lot of blackhead and pimple on his forehead so um, I have him use it every night, um, and it, it's helping him clear up the um, blackhead uh, without popping it. So I'm seeing good result. I mean, it's not going to be overnight. It takes time to clean your face and um, really get rid of those um, blackheads. So if you, you know, if you take your time and you do it consistently, eventually it's going to help it help you with it because. Um, I might say it's working for my son and it also works for me too. Another question to me then, um, are you, um, when they using that product, are they using the AC uh, S for the kid too, the 
or do they just use that one? Um, so I, it? so before, um, so when my son started to use it, um, I just, I got the, um, I got the four um, evening uh, four it packs. Something. Pack? Uh -huh. Yeah. Um, and he was just using, I just have him use the oil plus the cleanser, the, the evening cleanser. Um, cause I haven't, um, cause they ran out of the AC, um, skincare, uh, package. So I, I haven't ordered that one. So he's been using that for like two, three weeks and it was helping him clear up. So now he's starting to use that with the AC, um, product that I got him. So he's been using that for a week now and, and it, it's helping him more tremendously with that AC package. Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much for the awesome information, Sister Me. Sure. Anybody else want to add on before I move on to our uh, the NES product presentations? No? Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and move on to our uh, NES. I'm going to skip uh, the product presentation. I'm going to go ahead and jump on to uh, Sister DC because she's pregnant, right? Well, I don't know if she's going to go to the hospital, but DC cross for you. So I'm going to go ahead and let her come. Come in first, and she's going to do a testimony on my favorites, vitamin C. So, DC, are you ready? Okay. Thanks, <laughs> Amy. Sorry, I'm very pregnant. So, um, anyways, so I have been using the vitamin C, as you guys can see. Um, at the beginning of my pregnant, I, I've never experienced this before, but like not with any of my pregnancy or anything but with this one at the beginning i i started seeing a lot of stars and i didn't know why so then um my doctor was like okay well i don't think you have enough like um i'm assuming you don't have enough like vitamin c or anything so i was like okay so i took this i actually took this um package to OBGYN and I asked him is it safe if I take this during my pregnancy because I don't know if it's safe and he looked at it and he was like okay like it sounds like you know um everything in there is safe for you to take so then I started taking this and then so I noticed that I don't see stars anymore I stopped seeing stars and I stopped feeling like every single time when I get up like I would feel like I would faint so Ever since I started taking this, um, I stopped feeling like that. And then um, I feel like um, I don't really drink a lot of water. So then um, I feel like sometimes like when I get up, I would be so dehydrated and stuff. But then like I would go straight and eat this and then I would feel a little better. Like my my head would be light or not like like i would feel better i don't feel like my body is heavy and i feel like it also helped me like um i was very like amy probably know i was i was very i had like very bad morning sickness i could not eat i was losing weight and everything so then this was actually helping me like um when i was losing a lot of weight and i couldn't eat my dog um i like I consulted my doctor and then so he was like, okay, he he wanted me to try this. So I was like, okay, so I tried it and then like my blood was good and everything. So he was like, I, I think your vitamin C is helping you. You know, so I was like, okay, yeah, because you know, my every single time when I feel nauseous, I, I would take one and then I feel I will feel better. So then like a lot of girls who got this from me was like okay like this lady also got it from me and she's like i'm pregnant can i take it and i told her yeah I, i'm pretty sure you could take it because my doctor said my OBGYN said that it's safe for me to take so i don't see why it's not safe for you to take so i feel like it has helped me with um my nauseous it also helped me with um like me seeing stars you know i like headaches yeah and then so i i let my kids eat it too my one year old um every day i would give her one and then i also have my four year old she takes it too so honestly they have not been sick um ever since we've been taking these vitamin c they haven't been sick and then my daughter my one year old um 
I stopped giving to her like just a couple a couple weeks ago. And out of the blue, she was so sick. And I was like, oh my God, like I didn't know why she was so sick. So then I started giving this to her again. And then she felt better, like she stopped throwing up. So then now like we're continuing to give my um, daughters these every day. And so far, I feel like for the past few days, they haven't been sick. So that's something that um, I do recommend for you guys, because I feel like it's, it's helping me and my family. So I hope it will help you guys as well. Especially like when you're like, when you live in the winter or like almost every other month, you know, like there's snow and the weather is always changing. Your kid gets sick and stuff. So then to me, I feel like this is helping them a lot because when I stopped giving this to her, all of a sudden she woke up throwing up and everything. And then I was like, okay, so then I started giving it to her again and then she felt better. So she hasn't been throwing up lately. So I feel like the vitamin C has been helping our immune system. Yeah. Thank you for the great testimony, DC. Anybody want to add on to it? Maybe I would like to add. Mm -hmm. uh, my daughter's, uh, she is 11 year old. Mm -hmm. She loved to play with slime. Every time we went shop, she grabbed a slime home and she gonna, you know, play with it all the time. Mm -hmm. But one day, all her finger become having a lot of bump around it, both hands, they turn itch. Yes, I tried um, the three second water beauty. I try it help it help calm down redness, itchiness, warm it and reducing those. And also I also use the uh, hand therapy. Mm -hmm. It helped calm, but not totally uh, decrease the itchiness, like uh, release the, uh, the swollen, you know? So I decided to use the vitamin C. Since she's only 11, so I broke in half and I let her take each day a half. Um, her bump that happened onto her four fingers in both hands um, has been gone. Awesome. That's a great testimony. Wow. Yeah. Just give a FOI in there that we have a lot of, I'm going to say this. I know that the question is going to come up. Uh, kids are okay to take vitamin C. Okay. If you guys go do your research on it, they're saying that uh, children are daily take for vitamin C is 400. And then for uh, any kids that above nine to 10 are 1200 milligram. And as us as adults is 18 milligrams per a day. So it's fine. I think our vitamin C come with fine of uh, 500 milligram. So if you feel like your kids are as small as DC kids, I think she's only two. So she split it in half. Uh, I just want to say out there because I know the questions is coming up with always pop up at questions. So you guys are safe. OK. And again, uh, I was at the office earlier. Uh, one of the ladies, she also pregnant. And then she say she her uh, doctor was telling her that she need more ions. But based on her research, she's saying that she don't know what to give iron from. And she uh, she's kind of scared of taking, uh, you know, different irons. And, you know, they have the Korean irons. So I showed it to her. And I also showing the vitamin C. And I told her that if she don't want, because she's familiar with the vitamin C. But, uh, you know, I just told her that, okay, if she don't take the irons helping her, then all she need to do is, is she feel more safe, more safe to take the vitamin C than go for it. Because vitamin, vitamin C is also help you to produce your own irons as well. So I just told her that. So just uh, FYI for those of you that are pregnant, I, vitamin C is safe for you. Anybody that want to add on to our vitamin C? Amy, yes. can I add one? Yeah, go for it, sis. Um, so with the vitamin C, um, I was taking the, I've been taking the vitamin C for a month now. Um, so this is kind of like for um, women with menstrual cramps. Like if you have really bad menstrual cramps, um, I've experienced that because um, I had really bad menstrual cramp every time I, I have mine. Um, I noticed that by taking the vitamin C this whole month, um, starting my, uh, when I start my period this month, I noticed that I, I wasn't getting any cramps. And normally I get back pain and uh, body aches, 
um, and that gives me a sign that I'm very close to my menstrual time. But this time I didn't feel any backache or any body aches at all. So I was kind of surprised. I was like, wow, that um, taking vitamin C, it's helping me, uh, it's helping regulate my blood. So I'm not getting cramps and um, I'm not getting that back pain. So that does help. So if anybody has um, back cramps um, with their menstrual, vitamin C is a plus for me right now. <laughs> That's good to know. I think a lot of ladies out there, we all have cramps. I mean, like I have cramps, but um, I, the hemohan helped me, but I think because of the vitamin C as well, because I took it together. So, yeah. I agree. I like that too. That exactly, that's exactly what I use it for. It's my daily supplement right now with my uh, pomegranate beauty too, because I'm those people who has horrible menstrual cramps. I don't ever want to be a woman again. But with <laughs> vitamin C, I can, be, uh, I can still be a woman. <laughs> yeah. I agree, Sister Chai. When I was young, as my teen, terrible, terrible. Mm. But you changed me when I got married and having kids. It's changed a little bit. Yeah. So, any more? Any any more that you guys uh, want to throw out there and share? Uncle Mai, you want to share? <laughs> yes. Thank you. Uh, first, on the one with the uh, the iron. The 100% um, pure spirulina, it has iron. I would highly recommend that they take that. I'm not sure how much what the dose is, but because it is so full and rich of so many vitamins and nutrients, uh, I would definitely go that way. Vitamin C is so very important. Vitamin C is one of the one vitamins that will actually go to every cell in the body, okay? Every cell. Vitamin C is so important. I believe if the pharmaceutical industry could outlaw it, they would, because there was a doctor, he died years ago, but he had said that he had believed that vitamin C could even cure cancer. Yeah. Vitamin C, it is so, so important. Yeah. Yeah. It's a water soluble vitamin, which means that all that the body does not use, it will come out in waste. Okay, so those of you talking about giving it to your children, by all means, if there's any vitamin that you can give your children, you make sure that you give them vitamin C. Okay, it will make a big difference in their life. You've heard uh, different people say that their kids, how they're not getting sick. I'm telling you, vitamin C is so, so, so important. Thank you, Amy. You're welcome. Thanks for the great information. Uh, Mom, do you want to add something to it? Because I see that you're holding that vitamin C on your hand. <laughs> Hi, everybody. This is Monaco. Uh, yeah, I am actually taking my vitamin C right now. Uh, there's been study about vitamin C that would actually help fight uh, cold and flu. So right now, a lot of issues out there. We should all develop on our, on our vitamin C. Thank you, Amy. Amy, let me say one other thing. Yep, go for it. If 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 anyone is about to catch a cold, if you see a cold coming or some type of sickness, just take a lot of vitamin C, okay? And you will more than likely beat it, okay? Mm -hmm. So it is so important. Don't run out. See, last year, like when I came in, vitamin C has probably run out at least. I've been in one year and one week. Vitamin C has run out at least, I would say, 10 times, okay? I have six unopened boxes. I'm not running out of vitamin C no more. Thank you. Oh, wow. Amy, I would like to add a little comparison. Yeah, go, yeah, go for it, sis. Before I becoming a, a member of Adam, or, or before I even starting uh, vitamin C from Adam, mm -hmm. I have been purchasing the vitamin C uh, over the counter. Mm -hmm. You know, the one they say the uh, citra, uh, mandarin, you know, those uh, chewable tablets. Mm -hmm. I just would like to throw out there saying that. Uh, Atomy vitamin C are the best flavorable. You um, not even have any thought that you don't like the taste. Just share it to everyone know that the vitamin C over the counter, even though they may from orange, 
uh, or tangerines, whatever. Uh, the tablets, chewable, they don't taste very good. I tried it, we've been through it, and then now I not even purchase it. Wow. Amy, one more thing. Uh-huh, yep. Uh, because you, we, you, you're all on a good subject. Um, you know, I, I love it when we're on this hot topic so that everybody's not falling asleep. Everybody's just, like, oh, my God, the information is coming to me. So I love it. Go for it. Now, watch this. So we're not, so with, with Adamy's color food vitamin C, we're not just talking vitamin C, okay? We're, we are far above that. Absolute quality, absolute price. We're talking being made from five yellow fruits, two red fruits. We're talking about this product having fish collagen in it. We're talking pomegranate extract, all these, these different things. There is no comparison. All that other Mickey Mouse stuff out there, it can even show up to the ball game, okay? We will knock it out of the park. Its product is just that good. Fish collagen, okay? Coenzone Q10, all these different things. So like I said, we got something in our color food vitamin C and, and the, the other and go on YouTube. They have some excellent demonstrations on YouTube. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks for the great information. Anybody that want to add on to it before I jump on to our product presentations? Yes, Amy. Yes. Go ahead. Okay. Uh, like Uncle Mike said. I do. I keep my vitamin C on hand all the time, okay? <laughs> Been in the company two years. I used to have a real serious problem in April and May in the Carolinas. We have so much pollen that comes down, you almost can't even see your car. And <laughs> since I've been in the company, I have not had any problem with vitamin C, okay? And my clients, what I do, when they get in the chair, they sneezing or sniffing, got red eyes, I say, hey, try one of these. Do you know within a few minutes, most people have a very good reaction to vitamin C because it's so natural. It goes into your bloodstream directly. And they'll come back and say, what is that stuff? I'm glad you asked me that question. So I give them a little history on vitamin C. I give them a little history on anatomy. And next thing you know, they're buying a case of vitamin C. Okay, back to you. Thank you. Thanks. That's awesome. So anybody want to add before you move on? Okay. I do. You do, Miss? Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, I woke up this morning with the sniffles. Two vitamin C, I've been good all day. Um, the other thing is vitamin C is also, it also is very good for your eyes. That was something I, that I, I did not know. I wish I'd known that years ago. And it's great for supporting your brain function. So like um, I think Mike said, it goes into every cell of the body. It's like an adaptogen. It does what you need it to do. But it absolutely knocks out allergies and colds and all those other things. Everything everybody has said tonight is absolutely correct. Vitamin C is great. Thank you so much. I'm going to go. So just bear with me. If you go over times a little bit, just please bear with me, okay? Because we always on the hot topics. And when we got the hot topic, we go over time. So please be patient, okay? All right. So I'm going to add the last one. Uh, for those of you, this is just testimony, okay? So for those of you that you guys like to drink like I do, I like to drink, like, you know, having fun, things like that. If you guys hang over vitamin C, it helps me. So... This is, I just brought up in there that you guys like champagne, you know, drinks. Hey, vitamin C is, is good for you, okay? It helps me. So, okay. So, our next product presentation is Sister Ganon. Sister Ganon, are you ready? She's going to talk about one of my favorite is the herbs day. Yes, I am ready. Amy, can you share it on your screen? I'm on my phone, so. Okay, awesome. I will share mm -hmm. that. See. Well, you pulled that up. I'm going to start. Okay. Yep, go for it. Well, I'm going to share about the Anime Herb Day um, pad. I absolutely love. 
Um, the Anime Herb Day Sanitary Napkins comes in three different size. Um, there's the panty liner, the medium size, which is the day size, and the large size, which is the overnight. Um, the product features uh, contains four natural plants. Uh, one of them is the alloy, which helps with the dampness and inflammation uh, relief. The Borneal Camper, which helps with heat and swelling. And it gives you like a refreshing uh, feeling, like the coolness. And then the Herbal Medley, which relieves itching and discomfort. Um, the Herbal uh, Huatinia, I'm not sure if I'm saying it right, but um, it has like, you know, prevents antibacterial and anti-inflammation uh, in it. Um, there are six layer structure in the pad that I absolutely love because the first one is a top cover and that is for fast absorbing the pad, the leak prevention cover, and also the high speed absorption pad. And then the leak prevention power cover, the breathing lower cover, and the strong adhesive cover, which is the wings that you can wrap around your panty. And um, not just that, it's a great shape. The structure of the pad are designed to give comfort and not to scrunch up. And it prevents itchiness, it eliminates odor. Um, it's made out of high quality materials so that you know that it's a soft touch to your skin. It's not rough. It won't irritate your skin when you have it on. And it prevents leakage, like the wings to protect your leakage. It's not like any at the convenience store. I totally just threw out my, you know, uh, pads from the convenience store to Anime's Herb Days because they are the best. Um, and just everything is made of natural materials. It contains high molecule substance. And the, it's, the material is also, it contains polyester felt as well, too. So, you know, that polyester felt doesn't contain any chemicals or anything like that because we don't know uh, what, you know, the convenience store doors, pads, contains, but anime, everything is, you know, natural. So um, I really love this. And I just wanted to add my testimony is that the panty liner, if you have kids who play sports and they sweat a lot, their feet sweats a lot, you can use the panty liner as insoles for your shoes because it will keep their feet cool. And second, because I'm a person who, when I have my menstrual cycle, I have severe crampings. So I love the herbal minty vapor that, that you know, evaporates out throughout, you know, the pad while you have it on. Because I find that it's soothing and it helps release um, my cramps. So that's all I have to share about the herb day. Thank you. Thanks for the awesome presentation, Sister Gano. Anybody that have used it, you guys want to add your testimony in there? No? Yes. Um, oh, go ahead. No, no, go ahead. Um, what I'd like to say about the Herb Day is I've uh, compared them to the uh, what I normally use for panty liners, and I love them. Um, I like the cool feeling. Um, they don't irritate me. The other ones irritate me, but the herb days don't. So I love it. Um, it's uh, they, they keep you dry. You know, it's 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 a, a good experience. So I uh, recommend the herb day. If you haven't tried them, try them. You'll like them. Thank you. Okay, uh, I think I already mentioned this. Remember, I'll pass only the herbs day is only thirteen dollar fifty. A thirteen dollar and fifty cents, okay, and it came with four package in there, four small pack in there, and then on the packet it have total of twenty pads. So in this box, it contains a uh, twenty pad time four. That would be forty pack in there for thirteen dollars. So it's not bad at all. And again, just uh, I I think it was Janita, huh? Janita, Janita, I I the same way as you too. So when I start to using the other brands like the drugstore brands, I have irritations and before i never know i i just thought that uh it's not because of the pad it's not just my skin that is having irritations but now that i start using anime uh pad i noticed the difference that there's no more irritations and i like that minty uh smell or refreshing yourself so those of you that haven't tried it you guys um you know have that just make sure that it's normal Okay, it's just the herbs in there with the mentee that Sister Kanu already mentioned is in there and, um, you know, just making sure that it's okay. Anybody that want to add in there? 
I do. Okay. <laughs> um, the herb day. One of the reasons the herb day helps to actually helps to reduce cramping and reduce irritation and reduce the the bad feeling is that herb day is made with cotton. The products in the stores, the, the grocery shelves are lined with them. That's not cotton. It looks like it. It's meant to feel like it, but it's not cotton. That is dumpster trash, garbage that's been bleached through an eight step process mm -hmm. to make you think it's cotton. But bleach leaves a residue. Those chemicals leave a residue and that's what's irritating your body. And that's what's causing your body to cramp. And that's what's causing you all the misery. It's not your body. Um, it's what you're using. Mm -hmm. And when they say, and I, I've heard young women say, well, my mother went through this. Well, your mother was using the same product you're using. So you're experiencing the same thing your mother experienced. It's not hereditary. <laughs> this is a natural cycle. And there's no reason for you to suffer through it. So use something that's going to eliminate that. But I've got to tell you that, and I didn't quite know if I should mention it or not when I first tried them, but that refreshing feeling. That was worth price of admission right there <laughs> you know I'm what sorry. i'm sorry gentlemen <laughs> that was worth the price of admission right there because it 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 just helped you feel so much better you're going through something you don't want to go through and here's your bonus right here it was phenomenal it was phenomenal mm -hmm. and um i know of some gentlemen who use them because when men go through, now I've forgotten what it's called. There's a condition that men, most men, if they live long enough, will suffer through. Um, and sometimes they, they need something to keep their underwear from getting wet because they can't control that. Um, I'm trying my best. Prostate. There you go. Thank you, Lord. Um, prostate issues. After treatment, there may be some dampness that they cannot control because they have to regain control of those muscles. They line their underwear with the liner or the medium, and it helps. It helps. They, they wear it. There was a whole meeting of men that I saw. It was for men only, but it was filmed, so I got to see it. And they were saying how it helped so much to have something that they didn't have to run home and change. They could keep doing what they were doing because they were protected. They appreciate, and they said they've been doing it for years, but they were afraid to say something but it does help. So some of the older gentlemen may very well be very happy if you ask them if they need a little assistance. I don't know exactly how you would word it, but um, it's there, it's available. There's something to them and it doesn't irritate them either. So- Kathy, are you saying uh, incontinence? Say it again. Are you saying incontinence? Is that what it is? Yes, that's the word. I was trying to think of the word. Um, after treatment for prostate cancer, there's uh, because of the type of treatment, they may temporarily lose control of those muscles. And when they have to go, they have to go. And the pads are available to them. It doesn't show through their clothing. It's something they can dispose of discreetly and go on about their day. Yes. So men are using the past. That's a, that's a great point. I really appreciate you bringing that up. 
Yep, there you go. Now not just for women is also for men as well. So hey, that's a really, exactly. really great. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. All right, any more before I jump in to our last one? Okay, so sister, Ch before I jump into the last one, uh, I did a little bit of research for the pads and it says that women's cycle is AB 26, AB 20, 25 to 35 day and then you start to have your cycle. And with that, it says in here, I just do it, uh, the research in here, it says that us women, we are going through 450 period. So when you think about it, just like Kathy was saying that you don't want to put any toxic in yourself because if you put it on yourself, you're going to pass down to your, your, your kids and your kid think that by it, that is genetic, but it's not genetic just because you copy. It's just duplicated from your parents. So for us in here, just make sure that we need to keep ourselves clean. And we also want our kids to starting to uh, get clean as well. Okay. Okay. Uh, our next testimony or our last one is sister chai she's going to talk about our, the really popular one is the herbal uh, shampoo and the uh, body set sister chai is all yours sis all right thank you i'm just gonna kind of do a show and tell with you guys this is my favorite set um because i did a little research when i came and joined anime um a couple months ago and i looked into it because i have a little history about my my hair and my hair before i come and try this set um so i have very dry coarse hair um i have combination skin so my my scalp and my hair is kind of doing the same thing too i have dry hair and really oily scalp so when i did the research about this set which i truly truly love sorry you guys can't really see it um and I looked into it because I like, okay, I blow dry my hair a lot and I like to straighten my hair and I like to curl my hair. So of course it gets really, really dry and frizzy. So, um, and I flat iron them too. So I did all sorts of damage to my hair because I like to keep my volume. I like to have volume. So that's why I love this set so much when I um, come and use, uh, when I came and use this set, I feel that my hair are feeling so much lighter I can have my volume and still have the shine into my hair. Um, everybody keep asking me if my hair was fake and it's not fake, it's real, it's really long. And um, now that I use Atomy, everybody just keep questioning me. And I was like, you can pull it now before I can't pull it. If you pull it, it will fall off. So, um, or even like just brushing my fingers through before using this set, um, my hair would just, fall off or every time i shower a lot of dead hair or a lot of hair comes off so my husband's always questioned why is there so much hair and so i was kind of worried like what is going on with me so i really really love this set so i just kind of go on and on about it so <laughs> so yeah, yeah i love the shampoo so much the thing i love about this set is that for some reason i love the hair treatment with it I love the hair treatment and the shampoo. I feel like they just marry each other better than the conditioner for some reason, because I feel like the conditioner, it makes my hair really, really soft and I can't keep the volume. So I feel like the, the treatment helps me to maintain my volume and it still give me that silky texture to my hair as well. And it helps so it's not so frizzy at the end. So I really like these two. So I, I was so glad that Atomy combined these two together. Um, I did bought the uh, conditioner separately and I try it. I don't love it as much as the treatment. That's just my personal opinions, I, even though it feels really, really great on my hair. And on top of that, the hair tonic, that helps my, um, even though I feel like at first my hair, I was losing hair, but I use this about once or twice a week and it helps my hair to regrow. So my baby hairs are coming out. So I'm I'm like, okay, if you're losing your hair and it's not growing back, that's when you have a major problem. So this helps me regrow and strengthen the follicle in my hair, my hair follicle. So I feel like my roots are stronger. Like I said, I can run my fingers through or I can brush it through. And I feel like it stays really strong. So now I like, I brush my hair more instead of just brushing through my finger, you know? So, and I love the uh, brush that comes with it too. And it just kind of, I just spray, like I say, twice a week. I don't like to do it too much because I feel like this one really cleaned out a lot of my dead hair. So I'm like, okay, I don't want to, I don't want to lose that much dead hair at one time. Even though I feel like it's growing back, I use it twice a week only. So you can kind of play around with it and see what works for you. That's how it works for me. So that's how I use it. 
and then yeah this just help massage it there and like i say if you losing hair from the back then you spray in the back i'm more like up here my hair is standing from on top so i i just spray on the top i don't really focus too much on the back because i'm using the hair treatment for that and the shampoo for that so this lasts me pretty long and i really really love it on top of that it also added my favorite body cleanser in there too because i have you know nasty or women sometimes we have some acne breakout back here and on our legs because i like to shave my arms and legs i pretty much shed everything from head like my nose down so <laughs> so i like this one for my body wash and it works like that for me and it keeps my um my skin from getting bumped those uh follicle bumpiness and acne on my arms and legs so i really like that and I, mostly i love because of the shampoo i just love that i can keep my volume i can curl my hair and i stay all day and it feels so light before yeah. using this set i use uh, the store products and i feel like my hair is so heavy even though my hair is really light it feels really heavy on my head so i will come home with a headache especially with work and everything too so I just love this set so much that it's give me everything that I need with it. So I love it. Thank you. Thank you for the great testimony, Sister Kai. Like, anybody want to add on to it? Because I have not used the herbal here shampoo. I use the rest, but not the herbal and not the herbal shampoo and conditioner. But I use their hair treatments, the uh, you know, the tonics. I use everything, but just for those two that I have not used in it, I need to get myself. I use it not right now, but I use it two, four years ago, but it doesn't fix me. So I move on to the ass loose set. So uh, with that, I have a bad experience with the herbal. I'll just let you guys out there know that everything is not perfect. But for me, it's just, you know, everything is not perfect. So you have to find what it fits for you. So for me, uh, I'm just going to get my testimony out there. But that is five years. That is almost five years ago, 2017. So I use it with a full bottle. And then I, when the absolute come out, I just turn around using the absolute and I love the absolute. But again, with all the great testimony and everything, I will go back and get a try and come back out and do my own testimony on it. So just let you guys know that, you know, everything is not perfect. You have to look at yourselves and it, you know, it may, it might be perfect for someone, but it might not be perfect for you. So just give a try. I believe you guys will find something fits. I do. So any other testimony? Uh, <laughs> uh, Come on, Mike. Yeah, I um, I went from the absolute to the herbal and I had noticed that it had helped my hair to start growing more. Mm -hmm. The only thing I do not have, and I just recently found out the treatment, I thought there was only one and that was the absolute, but I didn't know that there was a herbal. Mm -hmm. So that's going to be the next thing that I order. But I use the tonic, the uh, shampoo, conditioner, and the body cleanser from the herbal set, and it is uh, it is great. I mean, I really like it. I can't wait to get the the herbal hair treatment. Uh, so yeah, great great products. Hi, I have a question. You'll love it, Uncle Mike. I love it. It's my favorite. Yes, I can't wait to get it. <laughs> you will have to come out and give us a testimony. Stephanie, I think I heard you want to ask. Yeah, question. I have a question. I heard a lot of people give good reviews about the herbal mm -hmm. shampoo. And so I did try it, but then I can't get past that herbal scalp smell um, in my hair. So how did you guys get past that? I did get the spray too. I didn't notice that big of a difference, but it does help give you volume. Um, I did like that part. I just, um, I just thought it would help me grow. I don't have a lot of missing hair or anything, but I just thought it would help um, enhance my hair a little bit more, you know, and I got that set and I have to always compensate with another conditioner because at least my hair is smelling like, like mushroom. Uh, you know, I think to be honest, if you feel that way, then the herbal is not for you. You have to move on to the that because with the smell, if you don't like the smells on it, we cannot do anything about it. You just have to um, move forward to the new set hair care because that's something that with the smells in, if you cannot really compromise with that, then it's time for you to move forward. 
Yeah, that, that, yeah. That, yeah that, that's how I seen it. And I want to let you know to shoot that. If it doesn't work for you, move on. Just the same thing as me. When I first time used the herbal, I noticed that I still have my scab. I noticed that I still have my flip. You know, so it doesn't really work for me. So I moved to absolute. And with all these great testimony, I just told myself that I had to come back and, and give a try, but I haven't. So if the smell, especially coming from the smell, if you don't like it, I honestly, you will have to move, move on because we cannot really do anything on the smell unless you use, like, again, unless like you say that you use different product and just overrides that. Then it's a different story. Anybody that want to add on to Stephanie on that? Yeah. Um, I, I, I say so. oh, go ahead. Go ahead. No, go ahead. Oh. I just say I at first when I try it, I thought it was really, really strong. Um, but as I continue to use it, I feel like it really makes me fall asleep so much nicer because I, I get used to it. So maybe at first when you're not used to it, it feels like it's really, really strong. Um, Cause, but then once I start to use it, I just continue to use it. And then I now I, I barely smell it anymore because I just become accustomed to it. And it helps calm my body down, calm my head down, especially when I massage it into my head. And then after that, I just kind of go to sleep. It feels so great. I just love the smell. I don't want them to change the smell. So personally, I I, I became a ginseng lover with that smell. So that's just kind of my take on it. And I think the reason why the uh, the herbals, why it may uh, be so strong is because I believe that when add to me, when they use herbs, that they're actually processed within the first 24 hours of picking them. Okay. So then, the, and, and if you compare them to something in the store, you know, you might be getting like this much herb, you know, just enough so that they could just call it herbal. But you're not getting that real herbal. And I think that's the reason why it's so, that it might be so strong because number one is real. Okay, it's real. And see, a lot of a lot of products in America are fake. Okay. So a lot of people are used to fake, you know, just like a lot of sugary drinks like the vitamin C's, the emergency, you know, they're used to that sugar. They're not used to something that's real. And I think that's what it is. So it's a great product. And I, I'm glad I can't wait. And and that that uh hair treatment I think is only seven dollars. So it'll be in my next order. Yes. Amy, I would like to add on on, on the uh, shampoo. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, um, like I told my story before, I met Adami. I've been using a lot of shampoo out there. Um, I wash my hair every other night, and uh, the shampoo out there that I use is causing my scalp itch. Even though I don't have a hand dry, I feeling itch, so I just scratch my head all the time. Since I met Adami, I started using Adami shampoo. The reason I bought the herbal, because they say herbal. So it must be smelling as herbal. For me, I love the, the smell of the earth. So that's how I use the herbal. Um, it helped uh, relax my scalp. It helped my little hair to be grow. It um, also uh, reduced my hair, I still has a less uh, hair loss, but I feel like those hair that lost, uh, loose out of my head, it's because the hair that is not good. But I, that's what, how I love the uh, herbal set. Absolute set, also good. Yes, like my children, they don't like the smell of earth. So, they're rather using absolute set. For me, I love the earth, mm -hmm. like a medication, herbal me medicine. So that's how I love the taste and the smell. Mm -hmm. um, one other thing is that the hair treatment, I love it too. It how to smooth your hair. Even though my, my daughter has tangled hair, she used that. It helped prevent tangled hair. Mm -hmm. That's how I love the... Um, herbal shampoo thank you you also uh how reduce when you love to color your hair it also how to prevent not um how do you call not losing the fainting the um the color doesn't fade 
the color, yes. Thank you, Sister Kanung. Mm, okay, thanks for the good testimony. So, Sister uh, Stephanie, just again, hopefully they answer your questions. Uh, if you, if the smell is a little bit too strong, I do really recommend you to change uh, to the absolute to see if you liked it. But this is what I learned from a Zoom meeting that I went to. It was uh, Peter Lee. Okay, so this is what he say in there. He, I remember he say that. Uh, remember that everything that you use in an anatomy, you is you always had to sacrifice something out of it. If if it helps you, then you had to sacrifice that. Hey, you know what? I prefer if it helps me with my hair. Then if the smell, I either pick either the smell or or go with difference and then use different brands and then my scat or whatever is coming back. The same thing. I sacrifice myself with hemohens. I hate hemohens. And human helped me with my cramps. And I cannot, with being taking human hands, I get used to it. So I would suggest you to use the whole bottle since that you already purchased. And then use it the whole body to see if you adapt it to the smell. If, if you feel like, no, you know, I cannot adapt it to the smell. Then I really, then turn around and use to the uh, absolute. Because as the so hopefully the answer your question if, if you use the absolute set and you don't like the smell either you can go ahead and try the scout care set mm -hmm. that one also smells so good too yeah i haven't tried the scout care set all right so um anybody want to add before i end it because we already go past 12 minutes and i apologize for that again when we doing the engagements and everything uh with the hot topic just like uncle max saying we always go past at least 10 15 minutes so please bear with us and you know if you guys feel like this is not the we shouldn't do go through all these engagements then let us know as well because i feel that this is how it's going to help us learn from each other as well not just one person's but if i use it uh you guys i, I i'm pretty sure that you guys just don't want to hear from my testimony you guys probably want to hear from other as well i have a question okay. this has mm -hmm. nothing go to do it. with what you guys talked about but mm -hmm. um you guys keep saying atomy is it atomy or is it atomy uh, people use different term. Uh, to me, I use anatomy. Uh, but if you, I was. This is a great question asking because I went and through. You know the Google. Uh, you know the Google dictionary. So uh -huh. they just say anatomy. They didn't say atomy. And I remember there's one YouTube that. Uh, 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 Amy, you're frozen. Everybody's frozen. Mm -hmm. hey, it's a Tommy. And she, when we, yeah, when we mentioned to her, have she heard of Atomy? And she's like, I don't know what Atomy is, but I know what a Tommy is. So then I, I'm like, I don't know which word to use for people. You know, honestly, um, I, I think with that pronunciation amy you know i think sometimes it's like language barriers too you know like some yeah. people has like accent and then they that's why they say tommy or atomy like see my sister they can't they can't say atomy so they keep saying a uh, tommy so i think it's like language <laughs> barrier too yeah because i don't know like a southern draw <laughs> well what do you think uncle mike i, I say atomy you know <laughs> Yeah, I think actually, it depends on what what region or what port, what country you're coming from. Because I know everybody say it's so different. Some people even say atomi, or like Google even say it their own way too. You know, so when I join, I just say in English in America we call atomy. <laughs> so I just go with that. <laughs> we can okay, <laughs> maybe maybe you guys can ask the higher up. <laughs> I don't know. Yes, I think atomy just sounds prettier. <laughs> <laughs> uh, when you, okay, uh, you know what? Oh, okay, you know the introductions of our, uh, our, you know the introductions that yesterday our Zoom meeting. I put it up. I they didn't they didn't say I told me they didn't say that. Okay. They okay. said anatomy. So uh, okay, yeah. So so you know the introduction of like, 2021. No, they didn't say that. 2021. I told me they didn't say that. Okay. Okay. 
this is Jimmy is saying that she, she introduced Adami to the Korean lady. So that is a Oh, you mute yourself, says. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. I was thinking that maybe Sister Jimmy brought that up because she said she shared to a Korean lady. So that's why they read the language of Korean. That's how they pronounce Atami. Yeah. So I, that I, I, I just brought that up. I think when you face that situation, then uh, I'm not going to argue with her. I'm just going to tell her, just like Sister Chai was saying that, oh, OK, I, I guess that's how you guys pronounce. I guess it's the same. This is how we, I pronounce it. But how I'm about, incorrect. Just say that. How about we ask Miss uh, Miss Sue? Miss Sue, next time. Uh, yeah. Right. It's her language, right? Yeah. We can clarify that part. Yeah, but to me, I think I'm not gonna fight for that. To like uh, talking to her friends if they're asking me that. Oh no, I don't know about that. Then just to me, I would just go, oh okay, that's that's. Uh, I would just think, wow, well, okay, now I learned something new because the people that I with and you know where I coming from, that's what we call. But hey, you know now I know something that you guys are calling that. Like uh, in 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 um in China, they call it by atome, right? In in China, so they call it by atome. And then with me training our China people, now I need when they say atome, I, I I was like, okay, how why is that they pronounce it that way? But I have to adapt it to them. So I'm like, okay, now I would just say atome. Yeah. You know, I'm like what you to really? adapt depend on what region we're talking to, you know. Yeah, so what, what, do you what do you mean? They just tell you that you just know multiple languages. That's it. <laughs> yeah. So to me, I, I think I'm not gonna argument with whatever, like if you go look at a lot of Zoom meeting, a lot of people speaker they would say at me at you know atomi, you know you know, atome or whatever. But to me, I, I'm not gonna argue with that. I'm just saying, oh, I just appreciate it. I'm just like, oh okay, I did not know that. But I guess now I learned something new, how to pronounce it. That's it. Simple and easy. You don't want to fight for it. Amy? Any other questions? Amy. Uh -huh, go for it. I think based on the structure of anatomy, it starts with an atom in your body. Yeah. And I mm -hmm. think when you use a single yeah. single vowel, you say atom and you say atomy. And then when you say more than one, atomia. Mm -hmm. Okay? Yep. That, that's what I pick up on it because when you get past that one individual or that one cell, yep. you go into the atomia phase and Different people use it different ways, and I guess different languages. You probably got so many different divert, uh, versions of it. It's amazing, but bottom line, either way goes for me. Okay. Sounds like tomato or tomato to me right here. Everybody <laughs> says so differently. We just accept it all. Yeah. There you go. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just accept it. Make your life easier. Just appreciate, and you know, because when you meet a different nationality, that they pronounce it different. If you kind of like, no, that's not how you pronounce it. This is how we pronounce it. You know what? The argument is gonna go there, and guess what? You're gonna lost it as consumer client. What they will hate you already <laughs> because you don't agree with them. Well, I think an uh, anime word is maybe stand for a nationality joined together, you know, so that's why we are learning many different language together. That's how we pronounce, we're learning from one another like that. Yep. So, Sister Jimmy, I hope we answer your questions. I don't know if you're still in here, but I hope we answer your questions. And I am. You are okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Asking me yeah. my baby's crying. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So hopefully we answer your questions. Hopefully we're not offended. Hopefully we are not offended. Any other people in here? But uh, you know, we just you know, just suck it up and do what you need to do and bypass. And hey, you know what? That's how we all need to learn in life. Okay, so anything else before we end it is 20 minutes. So I don't want to keep you guys longer than this. Okay. <laughs> so when in doubt, we just spell it out and they all spell the same. <laughs> exactly. Yep. Yep. Okay, so we're going to end our com with our company model. <laughs> so thank you today or tonight with all the awesome engagement you know uh, for my friends in here if you guys too shine hopefully that you guys learn something from us people in here that you know uh give out you know 
uh, talk about it. Hopefully that you guys are not falling asleep. You know, that's how we want you guys to. If you don't come out, I suggest everybody's in here to come out. Because the more you come out, the more the product is going to be on your head. Okay. So that's one of my suggestions for everybody's in here. And here we go. You guys ready for our company model? Yes. Let's do it. Right. Let's do it. Hey. Wait. You guys ready? Yeah. Yes. 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 What is that? Stand the fair. 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 Stand the fair